All right, folks. So today's video is going to be a Sunday tool day. What we have is Project Source, which is the name of the brand of this file set here. It's 23 pieces, including the two handles. Uh, one handle is going to be for the larger files. The smaller handle is going to be for the smaller files. This is going to come with a 10 inch flat file, which will be this one. It'll have a 8 inch RASP file, RASP, which is the one that runs here. It's going to have another 8 inch flat file, which is this long one here. And it's going to have an 8 inch half file or round file, which is this one here. And that's for the big ones. And then on the 6 inches, you have a 6 inch flat file, which are going to be A and B. And you have an A and B for the handle. So you have a 6 inch flat file, which runs here. You have a 6 inch tapered file, which runs here. It's kind of like a round file. And then you have a, well, yeah, and then you have your 6 inch, um, this is your 6 inch tapered file, which looks like a triangle. And this is your 6 inch round file. This here is your 8 inch double end file. So it has one here nothing here looks like a rasp end on this one and the best thing about this is that it also comes with a pouch i don't know what all, if everything fits in there but we'll take a look here in a second oh and here it does show you you have your a and b and on your files it does show your a and b so it also has 12 mini files and a mini steel brush which I'm assuming this is for cleaning your files. And then it has all these little ones here for, I guess, doing fine work, which isn't bad. So let's open this up, take a look, and see if we can file something with a little bit of crappy material on it, see how well they work. All right, so let's take a look here, see what we got. Cut this nice thick plastic up. If you want the part number, it's package folks so you don't steal the products well, let's take a look at this pouch Two, three, four. Yeah, this might take all of them. Maybe so. This is actually pretty cool because you can hang this from the wall. Or just roll it up and take it with you. But I think it would be a lot cooler just hanging it from the wall. So... I haven't put this together yet, so instead of wasting your time on video, let me figure this out and then we'll start over again. All right, so after a couple tries, it's pretty common sense. Common sense will get you in the end as you know it. So you have uh, room for your 10 inch files, your 8 inch files, your 6 inch files, all 12 of the little files. I put three in each pouch, so that's 3, 6, 9, 12 your file cleaner wire brush, your RAS file, your file handles, 
and obviously let's see if we can wrap this up see there you have it all wrapped up nice and neat you can tie it up with your string or you can hang it on the wall I will say that the uh, carrier itself feels kind of cheap so I'm not sure how long that'll last if you use it every day but let's see if we can file something Guess I can start off with a piece of aluminum here. I don't really have too much steel laying around, but this does have a really bad jagged edge on it. I'll see what I can find for steel. We'll start for the half round. It cuts immediately. That's actually not bad. You probably can't see it on camera. But it cuts really quick. And you got to remember they're brand new too. That's actually pretty nice. Then, let's see if I can find a piece of metal. So I got this super heavy gauge thick wall square tubing. It's got some pretty bad rough edges on it from the cut. Let's see how well that cleans up. So I don't know if you can see that, but Geez, actually in the first pass, it cuts it right down. That's not bad at all. That's not bad at all for being a $28 kit. Let me see if I got something with heavier burrs than this. How about a piece of stainless? I'm pretty sure you can see that, right? So what I'll do on this one is I'll grab the round end. This one's B. This one's probably B. Yep. That was fairly quick. That's really not a bad set at all. Really not a bad set at all. You got the half round. This one's actually cutting into it faster. I'm running my finger all through there. There's nothing there to cut me. And you have everything on the outside.
Cuts it right off really quick. So my thought on project source files is I would recommend them. If it works that well on stainless, of course aluminum soft metal is going to work fine on metal. I mean on aluminum. Um, I have to give him a thumbs up for that. Because it's not like I'm going to be using some kind of crazy metals or titanium and using this on those. But for, for a good little $28 set, Project Source with the case. Like I said, the case is, it does feel kind of cheap. Um, you can't ever go wrong with the triangular file for doing sharp edges and corners and so forth. That's it for Tool Sunday, Project Source. I like it. I can't, you know, I haven't, maybe in 10 uses it might go dull, maybe it not. I might do an update on these. But as for now, just using it on the stainless, using it on the aluminum, and the heavy wall square tubing, it cut it quick. So, good for me. Thanks for watching. Y'all have a great one. Like, subscribe. If you have a set and they're no good, after a while, please comment. Let the people know that they suck or if they're great. Thanks again.